Last time on The Legend of Zelda, Tears of the Kingdom. Quiet. Guys, what are you doing? You're going to get us spotted. God, what? I don't know nothing. Oh, boom. And now back to... How's it going everyone? My name is Sakota and welcome back to the Let's Play Legend of Zelda Tears of the Kingdom. In the last video we completed the water temple and brought the sludge away from the water. <laughs> the water's cleansed. And now we can do some more side quests in the Zora's Domain. But, uh, first of all, I came over here and because I was trying to uh, level up the armor that I was getting for the Zora Greaves on uh, upgraded so I upgraded that upgraded yeah see I upgraded to at least the first one I don't have enough to upgrade it to the second one but at least was able to upgrade some of my stuff to the second level even I got to the tunic of time I got that upgraded to the second level which is pretty awesome that I was able to do that um but uh, I was on my way back to the stable and um look what look what I saw I think this is Kilton if you remember back um they said something about uh something about Kilton being around woodland stable yeah something about Kilton being around the woodland stable and I was looking around I was like I don't see this guy because he was the other way he was actually on the beach over here. So, all right. What is, uh, what is going on? Go then. Yeah, traveler. The abyss is this cave. By any chance, I'm sorry to say, but right now it's. Hey, brother! <laughs> what? <laughs> <gasps> what? <laughs> Colton. It's no use. Uh... Colton? Please! It's impossible. Absurd even. To tr try to turn yourself into a legendary creature. A Satori, no less. Absurd. Hmm. You should be mugging on the monster collection for with me. Instead of chasing a silly dream like the. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> I would never give up, Kilton. I've always wanted to be a Satori. I would be a Satori. I don't care what it takes. I want to to get my fingers in a bubble, bubble gym. That should have turned into a Satori. Oh, wait, I have one. The rumors are true. There's a creature in this cave called a bubble frog. And it glows just like a Satori. Ah, but I don't think of yourself so high in the wall running around a nibbly bit like that. In any case, brother, why not get someone to help you catch a bell frog? Yes, yes. Do you remember all that treasure you collected? You could offer that in trade. Hunt for the bubble gems. Hey. Jala, did you hear me and my big brother talking? If I want to make my dream come true, I think you prefer to a bubble gem. Ah, but the bubble frog is so very nibbly, very hard to catch. What's your dream? You want to hear about my dream? I said about really. I dreamed about becoming Satori. You know, the creature of myth. Satori legendary creatures that have been spattered all over Hyrule. Piercing eyes, bluish white fur. Oh, how I admired since, them since I was a wee Colton. I read these ancient texts and they told me how to transform myself. Transform me, Colton, to Satori. I must find a bubble frog. Strange creature that loves dark caves and grows bluish white like a Satori. I have to collect a bubble frog, Jim. It's Bible that bubble frogs drop when they feel weak. I chased after the bubble frog lurking in the cave. I wanted to get my fingers on that gym. Ah. Oh no, a bubble frog could gamble about like that, so name it really. Yeah! I want to be a Satori. I want to be a Satori. I'll do whatever it takes. Ah. 
I'm sorry. But that's my wish! In my dream! My wish for doing such things! You can have bubble gym! Please give it to me! I give you treasure tree, I swear! Ugh. It's actually hurting my throat. <laughs> there you go. Yeah. <laughs> that's a bubble gym! Bolton? Is that the real thing? The perfect shape! In the faint blue glow! It's a real bubble gym! Real as could be! You did it! I can transform into a satori just like the other ones I adore! Thank you so very much! Please take this gifting in return! Oh, they gave me the, the mask, the Boko Blue mask. Yes! They act like all sorts of monster treasures. That is, monster parts and goods that make it look like a monster. The mask I gave you is what's looked like just a Boko Blue. So much so that even a Boko Blue won't take you for one. By all means, do try it on. Then you will see what I have with the body and the heart of the Boko Blue. At last, at last, the time has come. Time to come down the bubble gym. Cheers up, bottoms up. My body! It isn't changing, but... But! I do feel strange sensation washing over me. I can only be one thing. I'm on my way to become a Satori. And that means... Bar! I need to bury them! I can't just gather them up one at a time now. That will never work. I must collect lots and lots and eat them all at once. So do that! I'm like doing like a Donald Duck. <laughs> like a... Uh... <laughs> oh, shoot. Yes, I prepare! I'm starting to set on a journey to collect bubble gems. I see. Well, it seems to be up to mind. That being the case, you have my complete support. I think I have many bubble gems you need. My brother, thank you. Thank you. Yeah. Try to grip for your help. But I'm starting to set on a journey to collect bubble gems. Next time you get your fingers on a bubble gem, please. Please, do you give it to me. Do I trade you a gift for my collection of treasures? Without it helping me to get sometimes somewhere. Okay, so I give them to you. All right. At least I know who to give them to now. Hmm. Off he goes. I do hope he's able to make his dream come true. Hmm. Now, I'll be on my way as well. I'll be making the journey to Terrytown and Nakala. Hmm. You dear traveler. Thank you so much for helping my little brother. Although I hate to oppose, I do hope that during your travels you find time to hit the system further. Hmm. I'll keep my ears wide open for news. My brother's whereabouts to visit me in the Terry Town if you need help finding him. Yes, yes, I'll be going now. All right. The search for Kilton. <laughs> okay, so finally found who I can uh, give my freaking bubble gems to. Look upon cave. So there's a bubble gem or bubble frog in here. Yeah. Oh. Ugh. Thank God I have like a lot of them. <laughs> okay, uh, so if I go to Terrytown, but uh, you should just tell me. All right. All right, here they are. What I'm trying to say is, a Belka puts most distinguishing features up his nose, which if I squished upon his face like goof. It's serious, on the other hand, are quite worthy. And his horns go swift. Hmm, a description of yours. Yes, yeah, see, I get the picture. What's going on? <laughs> I love you. What a coincidence to see you in a place like this. Thank you for your help you, uh, with my little brother the other day. That bad content is faring well, thanks to you. Look over there. <laughs> he isn't there now, but when the sun goes down, he'll find his charming multicolored stall upon that hill. He's working so very hard to make his dream come true. You should speak with him when you see him. Ah, where am I going to say at the creature property? My name again is Kilton. What about time? I've been it for months, parts you see, and traveled all about soul and from my shop. But I gave my stall to a younger brother, and I come to this village to make a real dream, a dream so long. At this very moment, I'm discussing the, with President Hudson that very dream. Oh, it's you. So you know Kilton, do you? Mm. Kilton has to make me a monster sculpture, but uh, I'm not sure what exactly he wants this mon monster sculpture to look like. All right, I am. I'm off with describer things. I would draw you a detailed picture of a book of blimp if I could, but there's no art to be found in the bones of my body. But now, can I, Kilton, would describe the monster to you with more enthusiasm, which says, surely that will help. Very well, it would be better if I had a picture uh, to prefer this to. 
Do I have a Pokemon Blue picture? Do I? No, I thought I didn't. <laughs> Damn it! I gotta actually get a picture. Oh no, and it's a numbered adventure. No! No! God dang it! Ah, shoot. Well, can't do this now until I find a Boca Blin. <laughs> Well, if that's the case, back to, uh, Zora's Domain. Uh, one of the stuff here. I don't know if it's, is it, no, not that one. All right, well, we can do this one that's like with a fort that I saw earlier. It's just to get rid of it, so. I'll do that. Oh wait, there's here's a good there's a Boca Blin. Take a picture of the Boca Blin here. The blue Boca Blin, so maybe that would help. Here we go. I gotta remember I can take pictures. Yep, boom. 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 There we go. Oh! Woo! A gnarled wooden stick? That is much greater. Oh! Uh, um, they're dead. Na -na -na -na. Hold on. Rewind that back. Boop. Come on. Boom. Oh. Thank God it's taken care of. <laughs> Ooh, that, that sucked. <laughs> oh. <laughs> okay, man. <laughs> Let me out, man. Oh. There you go. Oh, thank you. I'm saved. I despaired. They can no one find me here. You might be wondering how I got here. My question to explain it, I must tell you about the Blood Moon. Some nights, no matter the moon's phase, the rise is full of red. Precisely at midnight, the whole sky turns chrism. And then the fit monsters appear again. There you have it. The Blood Moon. As my life's work to research this event, why do the monsters revive? What can I do to the Blood Moon? Or if I study the monster's psychology, I would discover something. But I got too close, and here I am. At least they just for saving me. Salted grilled fish. Haha. <laughs> <laughs> well, second thought, you deserve more than that. Here. Oh, thank you. Oh, I could have thought you with a pathetically small show. Thanks. Take this too. Oh, thank you. You think we'll see the moon tonight? Hmm, I hope this rain lets up soon. Oh, I'm sure we'll meet again. Now, oh, okay, like, let's put up before a monster spots us. Uh, okay. Holy fuck, a Lionel Reaper? Damn! 
Hey, I helped you out. I think regarding the subject of the fort, Monster Fort, we decided to gather some soldiers and then go and dismiss this. We'll make them pay for their actions. Oh, my fins are shivering with excitement. I defeated them. What? <laughs> so I guess that means you did all that on your own. Well, now, that's quite impressive, Link. Ha <laughs> ha. You had to get our team prepared all night. Y yet you did us all by yourself. Ha. Huh. Indeed. Ah, <laughs> oh, let's leave it like that. We're so grateful that the domain is safe once again. Please allow me to take... Thank you. Take this. Uh, oh, thank you. <laughs> this was our war for fun for striking down our enemy. However, since our Jeff has already been achieved, please accept this reward, Link. You have more than earned it with your distinguished service. <laughs> yes, for me, I should report that threat is gone at once. Well, that's awesome. <laughs> It's actually just giving me money now that I have money. <laughs> All right. Um, there was another one here. This one says, Mai was crossing a bridge in the east of the domain, singing about hopping and skipping to a floating place. Like, what? <laughs> Bridge to an east. How far east? Like over here at the islands or east of the domain? I don't know. I hear I can hear the guy in Korok right now. Because I remember hearing him from up here. I promise I don't know where he actually is. Oh, there he is. I gotta go to my friend. Go to my friend down there. At least he's down there. <laughs> no trouble for this one. We just gotta get you over there. I think doing that Colton voice really, uh... Killed my voice. <laughs> oh my god, that that was not. That was probably not the best. Uh, best best voice to use for that. Quite possibly. Thank you, baby. Here we go. Here we go. Got some more there. Thank you. Well, the problem still lies. Like, it still says... He went went fishing somewhere dangerous. When he last saw her, Mai was crossing a bridge in the east at the Domain, saying about hopping to skip into a floating plate. There's a bridge here? Going towards uh, Davide Island. I'll mark it. And I guess I'll check it out. <laughs> Yeah, I remember when the uh, the Guardians in the first game was uh, an annoyance. They were flying everywhere around these islands. They were freaking everywhere. They're just shooting you down. So, kind of really refreshing to be able to explore without having to look around your bag and getting targeted for a freaking laser attack. Pretty nice, in my opinion. You know, I might head into Hatina Village, or I might start heading down towards Hatina Village, because I think, if I remember correctly, uh, what's his face? Uh, Robbie said that, uh, the lab there will help upgrade my stuff, my pure pad or whatever. I think that's supposed to help for, like, your, like, your targeting, like, your GPS. Well, I'm... I'm here. Oh. Mai did not drop all the way down there, did she? Don't tell me she did. There's no way she would have run ran all this way. No way. Right? Right? <laughs> Tell me I'm right! <laughs> the 
Heck. Bing. Wow. Well, I gotta take a picture of you. Bing. <laughs> Link. Ace photographer. Uh, uh. Nope. Gotcha. No, it's gonna thunderstorm. God damn it. Oh my god, dude, that was so close. Oh. Well, there's another Korok thing over there. God damn it. Fall down. Wait, is that is that an air trap for the? Oh my god! Fat frog just suicided. Nice. <laughs> yeah, I can take pictures of the uh, the insects and such. Not just monsters. Yeah, I think uh, uh, this is definitely not the right place to go. <laughs> uh oh, quick, take a picture. Take the pictures. Ah! Well, there's a chasm over here, so probably just jump into that one. And it's like, screw it, because I don't... Ah! It's like, because I don't know. You freaking thing. Ow! God! Oh my. Tinko Island Chasm. Yep. Drop down in here. Uh. Just figure out where the light route's at. Which. I. Don't. Know. I don't know where it is. God. Oh. All right. Ah. Damn it. See, I'm here now, but. Um, yeah, you're saying it's over here. Frick me. Oh my god, dude, they keep putting walls up. Oh, I'm just trying to get to this freaking light route, guys. I'm sorry, that's taking me time to get there, but damn. there yet God. there's a chest over here what in the world it's in this chest looks like it should be important oh it's the freaking oh it's the cap Cap for the Wind Waker uh, stuff. Oh, crap. Oh, 
no. No! Ugh. What the crap? Phantom Cannon? Whoa, 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 hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold no. Phantom Ganon? What is this crap? Uh uh um Okay. Oh the Master Sword's lighting up now. Blade gleams with a sacred luster that can oppose the tunic. It's glowing. Oh, I can use that. Okay, okay, okay. Um, heat up. Heat the frick up. Oh, what is this? Take a picture. <laughs> ah. Come on. Ah. Yeah. Oh, God damn it. Uh. No, my timing. Uh. Oh, there we go. Uh, 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 um. uh. That's right, Phantom Ganon. Boom. Gloom Sword? Said to end the life of anyone who touches it. Its gloom will gradually wear down the body of its wielder. Oh. Demon King's Bow. A magical bow. The higher maximum number of hearts, the more attack power increases. <gasps> what? Yo, that's crazy. Oh my gosh. You actually get the, uh... Yo, that's crazy, man. Alright. I was not expecting to fight a uh, uh, Phantom Ganon like that. <laughs> or any Phantom Ganon whatsoever. Okay. <laughs> uh, okay, I was not expecting all of that. That was uh, pretty intense. Can I just get this freaking light route now? I would very much like that. I can go on my merry way. Oh, uh, no. Okay. How the heck does one get out of here? Oh, it glows when you're near the gloom stuff. Oh. I guess the sword is better for gloom. Alright. Alright, screw it. I've been going this for like a fucking half hour. I'm not doing this anymore. I've literally been running around forever, dude. I'm not doing it. I don't care anymore! Uh problem thing, it was just I I couldn't I there's just so many walls to climb, and I, there's no real clear path, and I don't know where I'm going, so. Sorry, but I'll figure it out later. Right now, I just, I, I, I've been taking too long on that, man. Too long. So dumb. Alright, so. Now, I'm gonna do the one that's about the blue stone. That is in this cave. I thought it was supposed to be like a luminous stone thing, but I guess not. So, there's gonna be some kind of blue stone. I gotta look for. I guess. Which I thought I went in here before. So. Can't be talking about this stuff, right? Really? All right, well, bring this over, I guess. 
Hey man, I think I got you stoned for ya. Um... I'm, I'm hoping that's just it. Is that it? It's floating now. <laughs> Magic. <laughs> oh, the stone! Yes, that is it! This is it! That water is stone! Um, I lost my composure for the moment there. Such are the depths of my joy. Did you by chance carry this heavy stone all the way here? Uh huh. Oh. A thousand times, I thank you. Now I can fix up me for court. Link, you must allow me to thank you. Please take this to love my gratitude and complete awe. Some elegant fabric that has the Zona Zora emblem stitched onto it. Hope you like it. Oh, you got the fabric to put it on the frickin' paraglider! Mm. Alright, I shall now set off to begin my repair work. Link, it is so fortuitous that you were here to help. Thank you, truly. Yay. Okay. That one's done. Uh, is there anything else here? I mean, most of these are just kind of like... I need to find crabs. Uh, I need to find my... Somewhere across a bridge in the east domain, but... I thought... It's not here, right? Because I thought I'd check there just in case, but... I don't know. Uh, I might just head on over to the, uh... This tower. Yeah, I'm just gonna do that. I'm just gonna go to the tower. Oh, there's a, uh... One of the other emblems. Right there! Geoglyph. Up. I gotta figure out which one is uh the next one technically to look for. Cause the last one I've done was Was it the Sonia one? Yeah, it was where Sonia was talking to uh Zelda. And <laughs> Zelda was talking about Link. Cause this is the this 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 is the in-between one before uh, Ganondorf pretty much takes over. Okay, right, well, we're eventually going to get to this tower. Uh, drank the uh, Enduring freaking elixir, so... Oh god, it's cold! It's so cold! Ah, it's so cold! I'm going to freeze my butt off. Oh, no. Uh, oh, okay, that's better. <laughs> Now, it kind of reminds me that, uh, when I get back to the Gru Desert, I'm going to have to find something that would help me, uh, endure the heat. I got to think for a hot weather attack, but that's not going to help me out whatsoever. I got to figure that out sometime. Ooh, there's a shrine right there. Mark that shrine. All right. About to get to this tower. Is this the... Oh my god, this is the last tower. I just realized, this is the last tower I need. Awesome. Mount Lanaru Skyview Tower. Alrighty. Yeah. Here we go. The final tower sequence. Bum. Um. Oh my. Woo. All right. And boom. Service map complete. It's all complete. Yeah! <laughs> Alright, I got them all. I got them all! Can I get a reward for this? <laughs> okay, so... Looks like this is one of the other, uh... 
drop freaking minigame things. I'm uh we're quickly gonna just check this out. Look at this. Whoa! Look at this little contraption. Should help me uh, fly around. Uh-oh. It's eating up the batteries, Joe. That's not very good. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Uh, made it. Oh. Okay, there's more. Freaking more. Oh crap, I just realized. I have my freaking other bow on. No, I don't want to use that bow. Oh, there's another freaking shrine quest. That's awesome. What of this crap? Got it through. Woo! Mayanas Shrine. That guy just freaking suicided, by the way. Why is everyone doing that all of a sudden? What am I doing? Hey, uh, you, uh, the guy that just touched that. Can you, uh, go find the crystal or something? Ah, uh, sure. Oh, here we go. There's my point to you. Oh, my God. It's over there. Force ostrich? Why are they up here? Oh! That was right as soon as I got on that. Oh. Oh no. They're firing at me. No. Uh. Oh, hey. <laughs> Just like the same one. Wait. Aha. Nope. There's one. Two. Three. Yeah. Oh my god, how did you know to do that? That was crazy. Oh my god, here's my cork scene. There you go. Ah! Back on ostrich. No. Just want to take a picture of this radish. Just taking pictures of everything. Because now I just remember to use that. So I'm taking pictures of everything. Everything and everything. Hey, look. It's like the same exact one. <laughs> Here we go. Ah! <laughs> All right. Just got to aim. All right, go down and drop. Oh, um, all right, we're just going to keep on going. <laughs> oh, no, they're going to fire rockets of it up. Um, turn. Ah. You're down. Oh, made it. Okay, we did it. Yeah. Do its thing now. Oh, that's awesome. You did it. Look at just go. Rawr. Okay, let me in now. Oh, they're going to make me do stuff. Great. The ice guides you. Huh? Oh, crap. There's a bunch of ice fruit. Um, there's the end. Let's see. What do I, what am I doing? <laughs> oh, okay. Let's obviously make a nice. Uh, 
Okay, what... What the heck is that supposed to mean? I make... Aha! Made this... And now... Like that. Oh, that was so close. Yeah, I think it's just meant to be like, hey, this is how ice works in this game. No way that didn't work. God damn it. Oh my god. Please. Thank you. Alright. I was so confused. I was like, what is going on? Why can I not get it? Hey, okay, well, you can just end the, sh end the whole thing right now. But there's a chest, and I have to fulfill everything because that's how I am. What in the world is this? I... Huh. Okay. Ah! So I put these, like, next to each other, and... This should help. Or not, I... Oh, that didn't work either. Oh, man, that was close. No way. Oh, God dang it. I don't understand why he wants to do that. Like... There we go. All right. Did that. Whew. It's better be worth it. Oh, it's a mighty uh, Zonite shield. Well. Guess it was. <laughs> it's actually, uh, put this on here. Yeah. There we go. Now we can emit frost at anybody. Heck yeah. And that does give me my fourth blessing, which means I can upgrade again. Let's go. Alright. So all that's left to do is to go down to Oh. Go down to uh where this leads, probably the drop zone thing. And then probably get the shrine down below. And go to Hatuna Village. Awesome. Splash. There's a dispenser here. Hold on. Let me use this dispenser real quick. Get all the goodies. No, god dang it. Why'd you do that? Why'd you do that, Link? Freaking dummy. Open it up! <laughs> Beam emitter, springs, steering sticks. Nice. Uh, okay. So he's right there. But I'm gonna leave this video here. I don't know how long this video is gonna be. It's probably short as hell because with all my exploring in the depths, because that was stupid. I don't know why I kept that recorded the whole time, but. 
Oh, well, I'm at an hour and a half, so it'll probably be way less than that. But all right, guys, thank you so much for watching this video. If you liked it, try to leave a like, comment down below, and subscribe to the channel if you haven't done already. It really does help me out. Uh, viewership sucks, and I just got to deal with it. But I hope you guys are enjoying the content, and I really do. But anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching again. Until next time, I will talk to you all later.